strategy, you can use this as well. First, let me show you what are the data you actually can see within the dashboard itself. For example, the first one, basically all of these models are some of the in-depth tools which is available within SMRH. For example, Domain Analytics is this main tool uh, here. And if we go into the keywords, it's going to be one of this tool. And if I go into Traffic Analytics, again, it's going to be another main tool. If I go into Backlink Analytics, again, it's going to be one of this main tool. So what essentially it does it, it brings out some of the overview summarized data within the dashboard. But in case if you want to preview an in-depth data for any of this tool, you just click on any of this hyperlink. You can obviously see the hyperlink here and it will take you to that particular tool section as well. So you get in a summarized view. The goal of this is to not to give you in-depth data in the dashboard, but give you a quick eagle eye view on everything related to your website. For example, the first tab shows the domain analytic, like what are my site SEO power? What is my organic traffic look like? Number of organic keyword, its ranks. In my case, I'm doing any PPC ad or search engine ads. What are the keywords I'm doing that? What are the total number of referring domains I'm getting my backlinks from? What are the backlinks count for my website? For example, you can have multiple backlinks from your referring domains, so one domain. That's the reason you see 2.6K backlink, but the referring domain is 252. In case if you want to switch off to a different region, you don't want to see the typical USA, Google region, depending on your market and your industry, you can obviously change and see that data as well. Keyword shows some of the popular keywords which I'm ranking to. I obviously click on view full report and see uh, full data on all the ranking keywords, but it quickly also shows the uh, new, improved, declined, lost keywords as well for each single day. For example, if I'm hovering over November 6th, it shows that eight of my keywords ac actually improved, which it means that the rank in Google has increased. New means these are some of the new keywords which was not ranking before, but just now identified and started ranking. Declined in the sense it means that it was ranking in one position, but it has decreased a bit on Google Search. Lost essentially means that you are you are rank you were ranking on top hundred, but it no longer is found on top hundred. So you can get a quick idea in case if you see a lot of decline and lost keywords throughout this process. You obviously know there is something wrong going on your website, and you can make changes to it. And similarly, if you see more improved or new keywords on the metrics like you see here, then you know that I'm so slowly improving my website uh, organic ranking as well. Uh, similarly, we also get traffic analytics in case uh, how many visitors I'm getting, number of unique visitors, all this data. We can also see the data on how much direct traffic I'm referring, referral. This is based on the SMRush data. The much more accurate version will be if you click on Google data, now you have the option to connect your Google Analytics to this particular profile. The advantage is this because Google is the official source of information or the data. So you can get those data without even leaving a SEMrush. So in case if you want to see all the visitors and everything from Google, rather than going into Google Analytics, Google Webmaster Panel, all these different places, you can bring all those data into the SEMrush where it can bring direct data within their interface. And also it will use those data to give you better suggestions or better insights into those data as well. So you can just click on connect account, you will just give a sort of like a approval and you can bring those data will in within this section as also and will give you more insights based on that as well. Backlink, same concept where I choose the backlinks or the link building growth or progress which I've made for my website. It shows the authority of where most of my linking websites are going. It shows that most of my website, which backlinks are coming is between 21 to 0, where I should ideally start focusing on much more authority website. If you are a brand new website, you can immediately start getting big sites because it might be uh, making much more difficulty, but you need can get a quick idea on what are your scores. And obviously, if you go into the full report, you will see much more in-depth analysis.